Hey, hello everyone, and welcome back to another video of Study Lessons Komu. So today's video is gonna be so exciting because we are gonna see like how can we export data from your MySQL workbench to an Excel file. Okay. So in today's video, we are just quickly gonna look at the steps by which we can, you know, export any sort of table data into an Excel file. So let me show you how you can do it quickly. So right now I am in my MySQL workbench and, and as you can see on the left hand side I have my all the databases and inside my databases I have my tables. So first of all you need to select the database in which you have the table which you want to export. So inside which we want to select the table. So let me just show you my table first. I want to export my employees table inside my employee DB. So let me just quickly show you okay so this is the data which i want to export into an excel file so how can i do it so first we need to go to the left hand side we wanna find this particular table and once we find it we're gonna right click on our mouse and once you right click you you're gonna see this particular option which is called table data export wizard so you have to click on it so once we click on it, we got some options here. So first it is asking to select all the columns that we are going to export. So you have provided one option here that you can you know, skip any particular column if you don't want that particular column to export. But in our case, we want all the columns and all the data to be exported. So let me just select all the things here. Okay, then we can go to click next. Now here. In the file path option we need to give the path where we want to store the exported file. So let me just click on the browse and I want my this file to be inside one folder. So I already created one. Let me okay. So I want this exported file to be inside my employee data folder. Okay, inside this. If you want you can create any uh, folder or you can give any path of your choice okay so that now i've selected my path i just need to click on the save okay so i'm done with uh, this part this part like my i gave my file path so there's one more option you know to uh, we can export it in the excel or we can export it in the json format as well so based on your requirement you can select any one of two now in the field separator this is the main part guys like in the field separator you need to give the comma okay don't select any tab uh, pipe symbol semicolon column we just need to uh, select the comma here okay line separator is fine here and in the enclosed strings we don't want us any kind of string to enclosed in double quotes or single quotes so we just i just make this field as empty and this part is okay null null word is s okay we do not keep it as yes okay so we are done here I just need to click on the next here as we have provided all the uh, information. So let me just cl quickly click on the next. Okay. So this is now uh, informing you that the following task will be performed in order to you know export your data into the file. So you just need to click on the next here. And yes, we are done. You can click on the next, click on the finish, and now you are done. So what we need to do now, we need to go to the path which we specify. So let me just open my desktop and inside desktop I selected this employee data and you can see we have the employee data table now, sorry file. So if you open this, yeah I got my data in exported into an excel file now. Let me just expand the column so that we can you know uh, have a better look. So, if we compare this with what we are having on this, yep, this is the exact data. Swapnil, Sanjay, Ajay Singh, and all the employee department, official email, and photo path. So, I was having the photo path information only for Sanjay Sinha, and here as well, I have the photo path only for Sanjay Sinha. So, yeah. All my data is safe and is uh, you know uh, safely exported into an Excel file. So likewise, you can also do the same and export your uh, any sort of table data into an Excel file. 
so if you like the video please do like and comment and if you are facing any kind of issues please do let me know in the comment thank you